Hey, what's up you guys? It's Maria and today we're going to be playing a game and it's One Night Stand. I was asking my friend if they knew of any like short games and she pointed me in the direction of this one. Now, I've never played it. I haven't really seen much about it, so I'm super excited to get into it. All she told me is it's like a story-based game. So, we're going to go ahead and get into it. Maybe I can finish this in the video time, but we'll see how it goes. Ugh. My head. My stomach. I feel like crap. I love the music in this. Last night, sorry. What happened? I love the music in this. It feels very like... I don't know. It reminds me of like old Flash games. Drink. Lots of drink happened. Ugh, what's that noise? Oh shit, what up? So I'm assuming that this is about a one night stand. Um, by the title. My phone! Where's my phone? Got it. Shh, shut up phone. Mate, what the hell happened to you last night? It's Gary. What the fuck does Gary want? Why do we only have 8% battery? Gary, what does he want? Yeah, what the fuck does Gary want? Oh, you were out with Gary. Oh yeah, that's right. I was out with Gary last night. He doesn't sound too happy with me though. Should I respond? Don't leave your friend hanging. Yeah, we're gonna respond. I have no idea, but I've woken up with a banging hangover. You? Crap, my phone is about to die. I better plug it in before the battery runs out. That's not it. That's not it either. My phone charger has to be around here somewhere. Wait. This isn't my bedside table. Ooh, bro got some pussy. This isn't even my room. Yeah, it's not your room. That is definitely a condom wrapper. <laughs> Safe sex, you guys. My clothes, they're all over the floor. Am I? I'm completely naked. There's a bitch in here. Oh? Oh my god. Whoa. Who is she? Why am I in her bed? Did did we hook up? Yeah, you did. That's a teddy bear. This must be her room. I hope this is her room. But who is she? Mm -hmm. Dude, you bailed on me. I gave up a date to go drinking with you and you wander off one after one round? What the hell? Gary ditched his date and I ditched him? Shit. Did I really leave after one round of drinks? I can't remember. That's kind of a shitty friend, though. Hmm. Gary knew about the situation I was in. He might be able to laugh it off or give me some information, at least. Should I tell Gary about this girl? Yes, you should. Although, he could have gotten laid. And he didn't, because you did. And now Gary's probably going to be pissed. Hopefully Gary can shed some light on the situation. Mm -hmm. Ha! Bullshit! You're crap at pulling, mate. You're going to need a better excuse than that. Gee, thanks for the vote of confidence, Gary. What a shitty friend! Ooh. Shit. I can't remember anything that happened last night. It's such a blur. Leaving Gary seems to ring the bell, but I don't even know who this girl lying next to me is. Where the heck am I? Oh! Where the heck am I? This is going to be so awkward when she wakes up. Ugh, this hangover is not helping. I don't know if Gary's not going to take my word for it. I can take a sneaky picture. I mean, of her back is fine. As long as you're not taking, like, a photo of, like, her front. Like, it's just her back. I don't know. Yeah, take a photo. Crap at pulling, eh, Gary? Your sound was on. What is Gary gonna say? 
Me, one, Gary, zero. Ha! Ah, shit. My phone's completely dead now. And I'm still no closer to finding out what happened last night. What should I do now? Wake her up, fam. Did she just throw the covers over me? She's gone? Maybe she's a little freaked out about all this. Well, I mean, she probably didn't want you to see her naked. Girls are super, like, insecure. Like, even though y'all fucking, like, you probably saw her butthole. I know I am. I wonder if she wants me to leave. <laughs> Just go home. <laughs> now, she told me that there were, like, multiple endings. I'm gonna save. So, just go home. I need to find my clothes before I think about leaving. Gosh, stop it! Keep on accidentally right clicking. The sandbar, buy five cocktails. So you had like six cocktails, fam. You guys can go back and read it. This flyer looks like it has seen better days. Paradox, Monday Madness, free entry. I wonder if we went here as well as the night before. As well, last night. I vaguely remember being in a nightclub last night. It must have been here. But I wonder what happened to Gary. Oh. Oh. Hey. Hello. Girl. Hey. Um, sorry for dashing out of the room like that. I hope it didn't freak you out or anything. It's okay. I was just a little shocked when I was suddenly smothered by the bed covers. Sorry, I woke up feeling pretty dodgy and had to dash to the bathroom. I see. Is everything okay? Um, I don't want to go into it. Oh, right. I see you have your jeans there. Oh, yeah. Thought I'd pick them up. I see. Have you been awake long? Not really. I was woken up by my phone buzzing. Uh, I wondered what that was. It woke me up too. Sorry about that. Don't worry about it. This is awkward. I should ask her something. Let's go out the... Her. I feel like I should know more about her, but to, dire to directly ask, I don't think she'd be too happy with me. Uh, nice apartment you have here. Oh, thanks. I share with my flatmates. So I'm assuming they're from, like, the UK or something. Because it's a lot of, like, non-American. <laughs> that didn't help much. What's up? You don't look so good. Are you feeling okay? I feel terrible. <laughs> it's just a hangover, I'm sure. Well, I can't say I'm surprised. You already had quite a few drinks before I met you last night. Quite a few drinks? Well, there were a lot stamped off at that card. I'm curious that I only had one round. I'm going to get myself a coffee. Do you want anything? Yeah, coffee would probably help. Yeah, coffee would help me shake off this hangover. Is that okay? Sure, I'll go put the kettle on. I hope you don't mind instant. How do you take it? Black. Just black, please. Okay, sure thing. One minute. Wow. That booty, though. Yeah. You gotta try and keep it cool. I don't want her to find out that I can't remember her. Uh, I hope I haven't weirded her out already. She seems... Nice. Yeah, she seems okay. It's probably like run of the mill. Shit, still, I still don't know much about what happened last night. It's a pile of magazines. So, uh, keep on skipping stuff. Some of the articles sound pretty interesting. Shame I don't have time to read them now. Um, that looks like it could be a boyfriend. I don't. I don't really want to... Maybe her name would be on one of these tickets, though. But that definitely looks like a boyfriend. These hoes, man. It's a mirror. How do I look? I'm like garbage, man. She certainly has a lot of stuff stuck on this. If I loved you less, I might be able to talk about it more. What's this? Hmm, there's a load of gig tickets, too. Two of these haven't been used yet. I wonder who she's planning on taking with her. Thanks. It smells good. <laughs> I 
I hope you like it strong. It's great. Thanks. Are you holding up okay? Holding up? I have no idea. Uh, yeah. Okay, thanks. Good. God, this guy is so awkward. Just talk to her. Jesus. She really cut to the chase and asked her about last night. She must know something. So, that was quite a night, huh? Yeah, it was alright. You know, I think I owe you my thanks. Thanks? I was feeling pretty down last night. I'd always brushed off the idea of meeting up with a stranger through a dating app. A dating app? Is that how we met? Bro, you really need to, like, get better memory, but a friend of mine met his girlfriend on here, so I thought I'd give it a try. Though, it took me a while to work up the courage to go through with it. Finding the right guy, getting to know him, eventually agreeing to meet. You don't... He hasn't talked to her at all, because he doesn't remember her, so this... This all sounds pretty dodgy. And then he doesn't even show up. Oh, okay. What an asshole. Okay, I think I can assume that the asshole she's talking about isn't me. I was there for over an hour on my own. After that, I was ready to jump into a taxi, go home, and shut myself in for days. But then you showed up. Oh, that's so sweet. Aye. What a piece of shit. I'm glad you did. You saw I was down, bought me a drink, and cheered me up. I did? Yeah, I remember you sympathizing with me a lot. You listen to me go on and on about that dating app, douchebag. Haha. <laughs> so thanks to you, the night wasn't ruined. Hmm, she got stood up last night. And we must have met after that. Maybe I was just a shoulder for her to cry on? Although I did end up here. Well, yeah, I mean, girls get emotional, and then they meet, like, a guy who's nice to them, and they just dealt with a douchebag, so, like, it's easy to slide up in there. Like, I can... Not, not every girl. Some. <laughs> Please, just, <laughs> I don't need people getting angry at me. Whatever the case, it explains why I ended up abandoning Gary last night. A little. Even if I can't remember anything we talked about. Don't worry about it. I'm glad you had a good night in the end, although I think my mate's a bit pissed with me for ditching him. Oh, I'm sorry. It's fine. We were just in the middle of a bar crawl. I'm sure he'll get over it. I didn't realize you were out with anyone else. Yeah, I was out with Gary. We started at this bar his bro recommended. I think. I didn't even get to see that text. And it's, um, it's nothing. Hold on, which bar? Uh-oh, she's on to me. I can't remember anything. I have no idea which bar. Sure, I found that flyer in the sandbar car, but they could have been anything. I'm just gonna say sandbar. Really? Yeah, why? That means you left and went back. Huh? Well, that was the last place I remember going with you. You mean we went to more than one bar together? Um, yeah? Wait, you don't remember that? Hmm, seems like your memory's a little fuzzy. Yeah, so what about me? Do you remember my name? Oh, this is embarrassing. So your memory's hazy then? Uh, yeah. Maybe I can fill you in with what I know. Please do. bro. I need to know what happened last night, because, I mean, I just want to know. <laughs> Please do. It would help. Well, I was waiting at the bar in the Paradox nightclub around 10 p.m. I'd been waiting there a while. I was pretty tipsy and vaguely remember you approaching me. You didn't seem too drunk. We had a round together and then got chatting. We found a secluded spot and got to know each other. All the Paradox got louder as the night went on. That's when you suggested we go elsewhere. Sandbar? Exactly. Okay. But things soon began to get pretty fuzzy. I don't remember much. I don't think either of us were in a good state to make decisions. Ooh, somehow we grabbed a taxi and I guess we ended up here. Hmm. Okay. That's all I recall, anyway. As for you and your friends, I have no idea what happened. No worries. Thanks for helping me fill in some blanks. It's helped a little, but ugh, embarrassing. Oh, someone's at the door. One minute. Hmm. There's still so many things I don't remember about last night. Maybe I can find some more clues around here? There's a laptop here. Shh. 
Robin Smith. Let's open to her profile page. Her name is Robin. She has 67 friends. It doesn't seem like many compared to the usual, anyway. Her latest status says. Ah, someone is messaging her. Oh no. Are you there? It says you're online. I'd better close this. I don't want to get caught. What? Why didn't you read out what it said? I'm a fast reader. You should be a fast reader. God. An introduction to English literature. English literature and context. The rest of these look like textbooks around the same subject. I guess she's studying English literature at college or university. What a useless degree. Like, no offense to, like, any English majors. Like, I love English. I'm terrible at math. But, like, unless you're going to be, like, an English teacher, what are you going to use that for? There's also some DVDs. What is she like? Oh, she's back. Uh, sorry about that. Who is that at the door? Just a mailman. I ordered some books online. I wonder if she has answered if she answered it just like that. Maybe I should try and get to know her a little more. City books. I see you got a lot of books on English literature. Yep, I'm studying English. What a Okay. <laughs> I mean Okay. <laughs> I <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Those are just some of my textbooks. I see. Are you enjoying your course? Yeah, it's okay, I guess. My lectures are pretty inspiring, but I'm always juggling a lot of projects. It can be quite tough staying on top of it all. Listen, about last night. Yeah? Going out, meeting a total stranger, and bringing them here, home. This isn't something I normally do. It's never something that we normally do, hon. It's okay. It happens. Like, in fact, I've never done this before. Okay. Robin's never had a one night stand before? Bro, you believe that? Oh my god! Have you ever done anything like this before? No, I've not. That's reassuring. It makes me feel a bit less uncomfortable about the whole thing. I guess what I'm trying to say is, I don't want this to be typical. I mean, you're still here. You didn't sneak out before I woke up or while I was out of the room. I don't know. You were nice to me last night. Aww. But I did expect you to leave. Oh. I, didn't, I don't mean you still being here is a bad thing or anything. <laughs> She's happy I'm still here? I must have managed to make a good impression then, all things considered. Look, um, we didn't really get to know each other that well last night. Or, we, if we did, we barely remember it. I've ranted enough about my date troubles. Um, I've talked enough about me. Tell me about you. I am a person. Tell me something about you. Um, like what? Anything. Maybe if we get to know each other a little better. This can be different. Ooh, girl, you just, like, met him. What if he was a serial killer? You can't just do s Okay. Different? Like, I don't know, not as weird. Yeah, I guess. What should I tell her about myself? Your personality may be garbage, so why don't we go into your hobbies? Well, I guess I'll start with... Huh? Oh. I missed that. Sorry, I'll be right back. That ass, though. She's gone again. That was strange. She seemed okay until I opened her mouth. What should I do? I don't... I don't know if you should go up and help her, because, like... I don't know. Maybe she has to go to the bathroom or something? I'm gonna save. Although I keep on saving and not using it. I'm gonna help her, and then I'll come back, and I'll load. I should help. She didn't look well. Whoa. Why were you right beside the door? I was worried about you. Oh. Are you okay? Not really. I just felt sick all of a sudden. Maybe if it was something I ate last night or too much to drink. Mm -hmm. Is that my phone? Your, his phone was dead. Wait. What? What the hell is this? Huh? 
My friend just sent me a naked photo of me. What? Did did you take a picture? Oh no! Oh no! Shit! That picture I took. Did Gary somehow? Okay, you know what? I saved here, so give me a minute. I'm going to go back and see if I saved before I took that photo. You know what? No. I'm just going to go with it. Um, oh my god. You did something like that? This is all over my feed. Everyone's sharing this picture of me. All my friends can see this. Oh, yeah. No. Didn't mean to do that. I'm loading. I'm sorry. Gotta go. No, don't overwrite it. Load game! Please tell me I saved. Oh, no. Is she still... Is she gone? <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> okay, well, I'm just gonna load back to where I was. No, don't overwrite. I'm just gonna get this ending. What should I do? Helper. Oh god, I'm such an asshole. Why would Gary post that? Okay, we've already seen all this. Everyone sharing this picture of me. All my friends can see this. All my family. And my brother is on here. What's wrong with you? Why did you do this? Uh... Just stay quiet. I don't want to hear your excuses anyway. Please just get out of here. Oh, I'm such an asshole. I wish I could just forget last night. Grab your things and just... Just get out of here. Oh, you quickly gather your belongings and, belongings and leave. Robin doesn't even say goodbye. She stays in her room while you fumble with the lock on the front door. Eventually it opens and you leave the house. You didn't expect her to get so upset. You can see why she doesn't have many friends. You walk hesitant. What do you mean you can see why she doesn't have many friends? You- Okay, like, I- I did this, but like, that's rude! Like, if you get caught, like, just be like, I'm sorry. <laughs> you walk hesitantly down the street, wondering how you're going to get home. That was awkward. I wonder if things could have been different. Yeah. They could have been, I'm sure. So I unlock the ending going viral. And there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So there are 11 more endings. I am going to go ahead and end this here. I hope you guys liked it. Leave a comment. Tell me what you thought. I actually really like this. And I think I'm going to turn this into a series. Um, hopefully I can go faster through the next one. Um, but I love this. So I hope you guys have a great night or a great day whenever you're watching this. And I will see you guys later. Bye!